great news. As you can tell, that is a garage door. There it is, the spot. The garage spot is right there. Yes. Thanks for tuning in to this edition of Wide Open Throttle. Thanks for tuning in. If you like what you see, make sure you like and subscribe. If you don't know why I'm making this video, go back to one before. World Volkswagen is homeless. So we have found a temporary home, guys. So it's awesome. Let me show you the new home for the Volkswagen Beetle for the next month or two. Hopefully enough time so we can work on it and get it done. All right, here is the shop. So this little bay right here that I'm standing in is the one I am allowed to use uh, temporarily while we get things sorted on the house and the garage there. Don't worry about the old Malibu four speed 350 right there. It's only getting worked on, restored, motor rebuilt, all the cool stuff. So yeah, got some shop space guys, finally. Found a place where we can work on the old Volkswagen here. So this is great. I gotta work on getting the Volkswagen. I've been working a lot. So sorry for the, the delay with the videos. So we had a week out after moving out of the other shop. And then I had a week I was gone for a wedding and family kind of vacation with that and then this last week I've been working 13 hours plus every day at the uh, at the store one of my other jobs to make up for the holiday kind of vacation I took off a couple of days and so I've been I've been there for the last four days five days 13 to 14 hours straight so it's been super busy Tomorrow's my last super long day, then I'll get into a half day, then I'll have a day off. So I'm hoping, if not tomorrow night, my half day of work, I'll get the Volkswagen up here, get all the parts, get them all laid out. Then we can uh, kind of make a game plan. I definitely want to just finish up paint so I can get the seals and the windows in. And I'll be able to drive it around then. Even without the lights, I can at least pull it in and out, and I don't have to worry about a tarp. And of course, since I've been gone, it's rained. Luckily, I've had tarps and stuff over the Volkswagen. Well, I still think it's wet. The battery's dead. I tried cranking it not you know, a minute ago before I got here, and it's dead, so i got to get that charged. So I just got to get things come in line so we can uh, use this space here, get everything over here, and we have a place to work on the Volkswagen. Alright guys, I'm going to show you some footage of things I've been doing, um, an ossification, I'll show you a little bit of Nitro Circus, you want to see a back flipping snowmobile, I can throw that clip in here. Thanks for uh, tuning in, sorry for the delay with the videos, like I said, it's been a few weeks, my goal is to bust out a couple videos every week, if I can get the time, I'm, I want to try to do almost daily for the next two or three weeks uh, being here working on something getting it out and showing you some progress because it needs to get done I need to get it done have a place for it I can drive it around start using it so thanks for all the feedback for all the support and uh, love you guys show appreciate all the new subscribers so make sure you uh, like and follow along if you haven't subscribed make sure you subscribe uh, we're almost 2,000 subscribers which is awesome so I appreciate all the, the new people coming on board. Again, thanks for tuning in to this episode. All right, guys, we're at Nitro Circus. Hudson just got his hat signed by everybody. Oh yeah, it's gonna be awesome today. So stay tuned for this episode of Wide Open Throttle. More to come from this. It's gonna be a fun day with old Nitro Circus. Oh yeah. Poster signed, hat signed, we're ready to go. Can I get some noise for Harry Bay? Watch and support this young man. 
He is a great human being, but he is going for something no one else is attempting on planet Earth. Well, he has not practiced. We need to get behind him. This is the first time of the day. Come on, St. George! Make some noise! I guarantee this is the first snowmobile being ridden in the desert in an awful long time. If ever. 75 feet? Come on, he needs to hear you, Utah! 